Hello folks, welcome again to my channel. We have right here my uh my R90. I'm gonna lubricate the uh the shaft, drive shaft. Oh so in this job I'm gonna use uh uh three eighths ratchet, quarter inch ratchet, T50, T45, T25 Torx grease uh, special grease for water resistance and of course the uh, final drive gear oil for the differential in the back we want to apply the brake the rear brake so that way I can take it out the uh, the rear tire Okay, now we want to take it out the uh, the brake caliper. Can I can hold them? Uh, don't forget the uh, ABS sensor on the left side, right here. Little cable for the ABS. That way we have more access to take it out of the sensor. Be careful with the O-ring. There you go. Okay, now we want to train the rear end. Since we are doing these blinds and this uh, this motorcycle. We always recommend uh, change the fluid for the rear end. Okay, now we're gonna check it out this bolt. can put the drain drain plug back I'm gonna use a little a block a wood block we can take it out of the bolt easily the, uh, the jack and then we can see this line over there there you go I'm gonna use this uh, this grease, special for uh, for axles and shafts.
Okay, after we lubricate the, the, the splines, the shaft and the splines right here in the bottom, which is the rear end, we want to put the, the boots, making sure the boot is in the right position. As you can see, the figure right here, this part's up, and this, the, the round part goes right here to the rear end. There you go, so the boot is already in, so now we want to try to put the, the shaft with the splines. So we're picking up the uh, the rear end, we're in, in the same position like this, And put in I want to put the the single arm bolt that way we can we get everything together making sure the the boot is in the right position in the back and in the front so now we know the shaft is already in from this part and from the back so we want to make sure it's spinning good that way we know this, the shaft is engaged all the way to the gearbox. So now it's time to put everything back together. Now before we put the, uh, the speed sensor and the brake caliper on the tire, we want to fill it up the, uh, the rear end. Right here is the, we need to take it out this uh, rubber plug. We want to use uh, rear end differential, final drive gear all 75 and 90. Now I want to put the brake caliper back. 